I'm Representative Kimberly Pine, and I want to thank you for joining us for this week's Inbox. We had a very busy week this week, but on a positive note, we've taken a lot of steps to save our medical centers that closed uh, not too long ago. We have a very important town hall meeting at Kapolei Middle School uh, this next Thursday from 7 to 8.30 p.m. And we're going to uh, and be inviting many different health professionals that will talk to you about what's being done right now to ensure that you have quality emergency care in the Leeward Coast. We're going to talk about other possibilities that could occur to increase the services. We have people coming from Wahiwa General Hospital, from Tripler, uh, as well as other uh, hospitals in the surrounding area, as well as the state to let you know the efforts that we've taken to ensure that you have good quality services. So I hope that you can attend that. We had some great things happen uh, just this week alone. Uh, we passed a bill out of the health committee that would allow us to keep the Hawaii Medical Center East open, but as a state long-term health care facility, we are desperately in need for that. Uh, right now we are making a priority to keep Hawaii Medical Center West uh, open eventually to stay a hospital with an emergency room, so that's our top priority. And so I want to let you folks know we have some more cybercrime bills being heard next Wednesday on the Senate side. At the bottom of this email, we will give you links so that you can uh, give testimony for that. A uh, lot of constituent concerns, now the session is, is uh, open. Uh, the gambling bills have been deferred. I know that a lot of people either supported that bill or were against it. We're kind of split in my community. So I want to let you know that it's been deferred for now. We do have a bill still alive in the finance committee from last session. And so uh, technically there is a bill still alive. And whether you're for or against that bill, you will have to lobby the House Finance Committee with your opinion. I had Terry and Barb email us from Eva Beach who are very supportive of the move over legislation. As many of you know, we unfortunately had a death on the freeway. A police officer was on the side of the road assisting another driver who needed help. Uh, and unfortunately, another car came from behind and hit the police car. And unfortunately, the policeman was killed. And we were very sad by that. And so uh, this move over legislation basically uh, tells people if you see an emergency vehicle or a policeman on the side of the road assisting someone that you have to at least move over by one lane to ensure their safety and so I hope all of you support Terry and Barb uh, from your end and support that legislation. Uh, we also had a question from them regarding a complaint saying that it was a waste of taxpayer money to landscape the median above limits uh, and in the, in the airport viaduct area and I want to let you know that this money was allocated when times were better uh, during the Lingo administration as a response to many constituents saying that it was the ugliest viaduct area that they've ever seen and they requested that we spruce it up with some more affordable landscaping. Uh, Deborah from Ocean Point is thanking us for supporting small businesses and she certainly wants to offer her support as well and has been in contact with our office to help other small businesses and so I just want to remind you folks next Thursday this is the time to express your concerns about the Hawaii Medical Center West Hospital closure uh, we will not be having another meeting like this on the Leeward Coast they will all be uh, taking place in town and so look forward to, to seeing and talking to you folks uh, when you come. I'll also be on many different television news stations next week to inform you about other further developments with the hospital as well as the town hall. Well, that was a lot of things to cover and I wanna thank you folks so much for continuing to join us for this inbox. As you can see, we are very busy here at the legislature. Please continue to let us know your thoughts and we'll provide the answers as best we can. Mahalo for joining us. I am Representative Kimberly Pine. See you next week. Aloha.